Hey everyone, welcome back to another video here today. Today we're taking a look at the Looney Tunes Golden Collection, volumes 1 through 6 right here. This is a 24-disc set with 356 classic theatrical shorts. And I've actually seen that there's two releases of this set. Volume 1 has 56 shorts. Volumes 2 through 6 have 60 shorts, so... 60 times 5 plus 56 is 356. However, volume 6 also has some bonus shorts. So, if you add all of the bonus shorts to the overall total, it adds up to around 375. So some people online say that the 375 sets are automatically a bootleg, but I don't think that. I think that sometime down the road, they changed the packaging to say 375, and then they switched it back to say 356. So, I personally think that there are two versions of this set roaming around, and it just kind of depends which set you get. I got a 356 set, but others may get a 375 set. It just kind of depends on what happens. But with that slight little ramble out of the way, like I said, this is the Golden Collection right here. You got Bugs, you got Tweety, you got Daffy, you got Sylvester right here. Then you got the main duo right here. You got Bugs right here with the three, I mean, not the three, the six volumes right there. Here are the six volumes packaged right here. And then here is Daffy Duck with the six volumes. And the artwork on the top is also really nice with all these characters up here. Really like uh, this top artwork. And then here is the bottom right here. Not really too interesting, if I'm being honest. But taking all of these out, it is a decent uh, cardboard box right here. Not great, but not terrible. But it's nice to have something to house these six volumes in. Actually, let me do one thing first have these out of order. There we go. There's the first three volumes. Volume 4, Volume 5, and Volume 6 right here. Really nice. And now let's go ahead and take a look at each volume individually. So this is Volume 1. Nice artwork on this one. I like this one a lot. All of these spines are pretty much the same, just with a different volume number. Here is the back right here. Really cool set. 411 minutes. And then here is disc one. Disc two with Daffy Duck. Disc three and disc four with Tweety. And I'll go ahead and take this DVD out. You can see that disc one is the best of Bugs Bunny. Disc 3 is Looney Tunes All-Stars, kind of a hodgepodge of different shorts. But there are a lot of great shorts on this set. Love this uh, first volume. Taking out the Tweety set, the Tweety DVD. This one is the best of Daffy and Porky. And then Disc 4 is, once again, Looney Tunes All-Stars. So Volume 1, really cool. Just getting volume one alone like volume one i think sells for about 12 bucks at walmart if you don't want to get this whole set just buy volume one i think that's a pretty nice uh looney tunes selection of shorts and then moving on we have volume two right here here is the back artwork Lots of bonuses in these volumes as well, which is really nice. 320 minutes right here. But yeah, there's a lot of great bonus features on these sets, which is a really cool incentive to buy this. There's Bugs on Disc 1 of Volume 2. The Roadrunner, because Disc 2 is um, all Wile E. Coyote Roadrunner cartoons, which is really nice. There is Disc 3 and Disc 4 right there. And I'll take this disc out. You can see that Bugs Bunny Masterpieces is on disc one. 
And then here's disc three with Tweety and Sylvester and Friends. So this is mainly a Tweety Sylvester uh, disc, which is pretty cool. It's nice that they got their own uh, disc for just them. And then like I said, disc two is Roadrunner and Friends. Disc four is once again, Looney Tunes All-Stars on stage and screen. So there is that. Really nice inside artwork in this. It's very uh, easy to know which short is on each disc and which uh, special features is on each disc. Really nice set. Here is um, volume three with uh, some cool artwork. This artwork on volume three is a bit more minimalistic almost. Have some dark space right here, but I actually like this cover a lot. I think it's pretty cool. I also like the back artwork as well. Really cool. We got the big three up here. Because Porky was originally Looney Tunes' main star. And there it is, 442 minutes. But yeah, Bugs, Daffy, Porky. Really cool back artwork. Opening it up. Disc one with Bugs. Disc two with Daffy. There's Porky on disc three. And once again, there's Tweety again on disc four. Taking this one out. Disc three, I mean not disc three, disc one is once again Bugs Bunny centered, Bugs Bunny classics. Disc three focuses on Porky Pig and Friends. That's really cool. I haven't got a hat. That's really nice that they, that uh, short is on there. And then going over here, we can see that disc two, Hollywood caricatures and parodies. And then disc four is once again, Looney Tunes All-Stars. Really cool right there. So volume three, haven't watched all of volume three, but I've watched, you know, a, a fair amount. Really cool volume in my opinion. Volume four is also really, really cool. Like the cover on this one as well. The back artwork is all right. Nothing to write home about. But there's the special features. 414 minutes right here. Bugs Bunny on disc one. There's Porky right there on disc two. Here's disc three with Speedy Gonzalez. And there is disc four. I believe that's Wiley Coyote, but it might be Ralph Wolf. I think it's Wiley Coyote though. But then here is disc one with Bugs Bunny favorites yet again. Disc three focuses on Speedy Gonzalez. It's Speedy Gonzalez in a flash. And then going over to the other side, disc two focuses on a dash of Tashlin. That one's pretty cool because it focuses on a Looney Tunes animator. And then disc four is, what does that say? Kitty Corner? Yeah, Kitty Corner, I think. It is a little hard to read with um, the spindle right there, but that's yeah, okay. But there's disc four. Nice volume right there. And then here is volume five right here. Nice artwork on this back. 417 minutes right here. Bugs on volume five, disc one. Porky on disc two. Uh, Daffy on uh, disc three. Almost forgot his name there for a hot second. Miss Sylvester uh, on disc four right there. And then taking out disc one. Disc one focuses not solely on Bugs Bunny for once. It focuses on Bugs Bunny and Daffy Duck. So that's pretty cool. Disc three once again focuses on a specific Looney Tunes animator. Putting a Bob Clampett on it. Love Bob Clampett. And then going over to the other side. Disc two focuses on fun-filled fairy tales. Kind of interesting. And then disc four is early days. Some of the uh, early black and white Looney Tunes cartoons. So that's really cool that they focused on that. And then actually, here we are at the final volume. I'm losing my voice for a second almost. 
but this is the Golden Collection Volume 6 right here. There's Bosco slash Buddy right there. That's pretty cool. And Elmer Fudd, too. The back is a bit more minimalistic as well, but it's nice as well. 413 minutes right here. And if you couldn't tell already, they got their hel helmets on. So this is like a war-centered, uh, patriotic almost um, Looney Tunes set right here. There's Bugs Bunny, disc one with dog tags. Elmer Fudd right there. There's Bosco. And there's Daffy Duck. This is a pretty cool set. I like the artwork in here a lot. And it's cool that they focused on uh, some of the wartime cartoons. Looney Tunes All-Stars is Disc 1. Disc 3 focuses on Bosco and Buddy and Merry Melodies. So Bosco and Buddy, they're kind of two different characters, but they're, they're kind of different as well. So that's why there is a distinction between them right there. But I think it's really nice that they made a whole disc focused solely on Bosco and Buddy. Really cool that they did that. And really cool they put him on the cover as well, I think. And then over here, disc two was Patriotic Pals. That one's really cool. Really cool disc. The Ducktators right there. That is a crazy short right there. And then disc four. I don't believe this was intended to be the final volume, but it just ended up being that way. Um, I would love if they would make a volume seven, but it's probably not going to happen. Um, but disc four is most requested assorted nuts and one shots. So most of the shorts that weren't included on the previous five volumes, you know, I'm sure that Warner Bros. got some letters from fans saying, hey, they wanted so-and-so short to be included. So they included it on disc four right here. And that is volume six. But there is volume one. Volume two. Volume three right here. And volume four. And then volume five and volume six. Really, really nice set. Got this for 75 bucks on Amazon. And it, it always fluctuates in price. Um, but right now, I actually checked, and it's at 80 bucks. So it's five bucks more than what I spent. Um, I've actually seen the, the uh, set down to like, I want to say like 68, 67 before. Um, and 68, eh, 75, you know, it's not a bad price because, you know, I mean, 10 bucks for each volume, not bad at all. 20 bucks for each volume isn't even that bad. Um, and, you know, the sets individually at Walmart go for like 12 to 15 bucks. So if you want to get all six for 15 bucks, 30, 30, 30, that's a $90 total. So paying 75 for this set is actually a pretty dang good deal. Um, but if you don't want to get all of these volumes, I kind of get that. Um, I would recommend volume uh, one. That's a great starter set for a Looney Tunes fan. Volume 3 is also really nice, and Volume 6 is also really good, too. Um, that's not to say that Volumes 2, 5, and 4 are bad. Um, I would say Volume 2 is pretty lackluster. I like the Roadrunner uh, disc, but the other discs are just kind of okay. Maybe that's just my personal opinion. Um, and Volume 5 is, you know, it's not bad, but it's not the best. Um... But I mean, Looney Tunes is Looney Tunes. I'll take any Looney Tunes that I can get. Um, if you don't want to get all of these sets, though, I understand. Um, I would definitely say pick up Volume 1. That's a great one. Also, the Essential Bugs Bunny or the Spotlight Collections, the Essential Daffy Duck. Those are great sets. Also, the Platinum Collection. That's pretty cool, too. Um, I want to get the Platinum Collection on Blu-ray, um, but those are expensive, so... And I do not want to get the Platinum Collection on DVD because I want the Blu-ray bonus shorts and the bonus features, stuff like that. So if I ever am able to find the Platinum Collection on Blu-ray for a decent price, I'll probably pick them up. But as for now, uh, I am content with owning the Golden Collection for now. Um, they also announced that they're uh, releasing a Bugs Bunny 80th anniversary set uh, in November. 
and that set retails for around 75 bucks. Um, if the set was $60, I would pre-order it. I think 75 is just a smidgen too steep of a price. It comes with 60 shorts and a uh, special Funko Pop uh, letter of uh, uh, authenticity. Um, so it looks like a cool set, um, but I think 75 bucks is a bit too expensive. But who knows? I've said that sets are too expensive in the past, and then I end up ultimately buying them. But as for now, like I said, I'm content with just owning the Golden Collection here on DVD with over 350 shorts. So really cool set. Highly recommend you pick this thing up. Um, just overall, really nice set. So thanks a lot for watching. Um, stay tuned for more soon uh, on this channel. So uh, yeah, that's it. Bye.